Nah, man, I ain't, I ain't got no smoke with nobody <laughs> today. What got into you the last two minutes of the game, man? Nah, I mean, you know, they, they trap Luca. Luca does a phenomenal job becoming a problem. Um, you know what I'm saying? For their defense, whether that's back downs, pick and roll, whatever it is. He gets two on the ball. He, uh, you know what I'm saying, makes the right right read, right pass. And then we were just, you know, swing, swinging. Um, and, and it found me. And I was able to hit a couple shots. Yeah, you have obviously got a history with like, hitting clutch shots here before. You, um, you haven't always been in the closing lineup. How satisfying is it for you to, to have that kind of but I mean, finish. Um, oh, for sure. I mean, you know, you trust the work. Uh, you feel like you're prepared to shoot those shots. You step up, you try to knock them down for the team. Um, and then whether you're in the closing lap or not, I mean, obviously there's, there's a certain level of pride in uh, being there. But at the same time, I mean, you, you trust your guys to, to get the W. So, you know, this is a marathon and everybody's going to contribute to, to our success um, in some form or fashion. So you got to be prepared for that every night. Spencer, I'm sure you know you're shooting. Nice. Coming to the Mavericks, you know, that's significantly higher than what you've been at. Yeah. How do you how do you explain that? Um, you know, it's just a byproduct of our team, our play style. Um, I I think historically, if you look at my career, I've been a pretty solid catch and shoot shooter. Um, and then obviously, I think I'm decent at the uh, you know harder shots. I don't think anybody shoots them with, you know, what I'm saying extreme proficiency. But the the ratio with which I took like hard threes, late clock, end of game, step backs compared to the quality ones, the catch and shoots, trail ins, things like that, um, was just at a at a different. You know what I'm saying ratio than it than it has been in my Mavericks uh, tenure. So, you know, you, you take more good shots and less bad shots, and then you also start making more bad shots because you you know what I'm saying kind of get to find it a little bit. So I, I think it's just kind of a product of, you know, the the guys, the system, all that. Is, is there do you feel improvement in there as well? Like is, is that how much is that a factor? Just like, do you feel like you're making more shots on it? practices during games? Oh, I mean, yeah, to a degree. I mean, I, I pride myself in feeling like I'm one of the hardest workers in the league. So, you know, it's consistent that I'm going to get in the lab with my uncle in the summer and really try to, you know, be focused on improving. Um, you know, and having a full off season this year to work on my game and, and not just rehab and stuff like that, I think also helps. And, but overall, I would say the, the main difference is definitely the guys, the, uh, the scheme, and then, you know, just getting better quality looks. That was quick, boys. Great win. Hey, nigga Sam's one on me. Uh, no, it's still early. Uh, as everybody in the locker room, player-wise, been saying, still early. Still trying to get our feet wet. But I think for tonight's game, you know, two tough losses. Uh, coming home um, to a great crowd, great environment. Um, the fans, we, we rallied behind them. They gave us that energy. Um, and we just try to do the best we can to, you know, limit their second chance opportunities and and make it tough on on their guys uh, to make tough shots. Um, so just happy that we came out with the victory. You feel like you got to get I mean, not yet. I feel like I'm getting there a little bit, but at the same time, uh, it's a process. I'm just happy that we we got the victory. Happy that uh, my guys trust me to be out there. You know, at the end of the game. Um, and uh, I just try to do the best I can to stay ready. The 19 points always been impressive, but six assists, is that something you take a, a special pride in? Uh, five, no, it was fine. No, it's, uh, yeah, it's, no, I'm happy, but most importantly, I'm just looking at the plus and minus, plus 23, uh, just, Try and do whatever is necessary to win at this point, um, just so we could turn that curb and forget about the last two games. So, just try to have that mindset of coming in the game, having energy, picking up full court when I could, uh, try to take charges when available uh, for the opportunity to do so, and um, just continue to shoot the ball when open. Um, that's all. I, that's all I can do right now at this point, and just try to do be, be the best teammate I possibly can. Is there any significance to you picking that hat to work? No. <laughs> nah. No, it's a fashion thing there, yeah. It's an honor to gift hat. It's from uh my boy uh my boy, boy Russ. So just uh, <laughs> just showing him some love, that's all. What's the hardest part about coming back from injury from 
last year going into this season? Do you feel different on pitch shots? Is it just cutting or? Oh, I mean, I think I'm uh, just jumping a little bit too high on my shot. Uh, I think I'm just so amped to be back out there that um, I'm sh jumping so high that I don't really need to. Um, so just been watching film on that constantly, um, just trying to get that rhythm back. Uh, but most importantly, uh, my guys are you know feeding me the, the rock. Um, they're telling me to shoot the ball once open, no hesitation. And uh, that's all a basketball player can ask for, that trust from his teammates. Thank you.